Monster Hunter is making its way to Nintendo Switch in the West as Capcom drops a Megaton announcement out of nowhere. What's going on today? It's Zach from Switch Force. Gabe is here, and this is really exciting and unexpected news. Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate, aka Monster Hunter Double Cross, is coming to Nintendo Switch in the West on August 28th. So finally, players over on this side of the globe will have a chance to play Monster Hunter on the go and on their Switch. The game was received very well in Japan. It sold very well previous iteration on 3DS, so it's not a brand new game, and again, this is called Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate here, Monster Hunter Double Cross there, but it's so good that we are getting Monster Hunter, and so cool that this is A, an out-of-nowhere announcement, and B, coming in just three months. Yeah, with the recent success that the Monster Hunter franchise has had on other platforms, it was a no-brainer for Capcom to just localize this and put it out over here just because there is more cachet behind the name that there ha than there has ever been. You really love Monster Hunter World, and of course it's unfortunate that that's not what we're getting, but fans in the West have been wanting this game for quite some time. They've gone as far as even playing the Japanese version because they are just super into the franchise, and having it in English now in other territories is obviously an awesome thing. Absolutely. I think it is a great get, and it's a nice pre-E3 announcement. It shows that, hey, the show probably does have some big surprises, given that this is being pushed out uh, a month prior. And, and maybe that has something to do with the fact that it's already out in Japan, so this is not like a brand new Monster Hunter. Um, and as you mentioned, it's a great time to be a part of Monster Hunter. World was insanely successful over on the other platforms, and you know this one sold super well on Switch in Japan, so I'm sure this... American slash Western version will find success. Uh, it reviewed quite well back on 3DS and again on Switch. I do wonder and worry a little bit uh, for a player like me that mainly dove into Monster Hunter World if it'll feel a little bit regressive going back to sort of this game that did come out a number of years ago and retains uh, more of the traditional style as opposed to some of the new elements. Uh, that Monster Hunter World bought, brought to the fray, but nonetheless, like this is a big deal. It's super cool. Um, they're talking like it, you know, it brings new things because Monster Hunter Generations did release in the West on 3DS. So if you did play that and aren't familiar with Double Cross, um, this is allowing you to take your save data um, over which is interesting. I think that's kind of cool, like from the 3DS to the Switch. I'm not exactly sure that's going to work, but that's pretty cool. Uh, they are expanding the monster roster, the number of ways you can hunt, and adding G rank quests. Now, obviously, this stuff is already in Double Cross, but uh, for, for most people in the West, they have not played that game. Yeah, uh, I played World um, a bunch, not as much as you, because uh, uh, you played a ton of it, but hey, now the ability to take this on the go, I recently had an airplane ride where I was like just like playing some games, and this would have been an awesome thing to be able to uh, have for, you know, those commutes, so I'm actually kind of excited for this, it's not that far from now, we have like three months now, so yeah, I, I like this type of pre-E3 announcement, I'm all for it. Yep, they say it'll be playable at E3. I just booked my slot with Capcom, and they said their games will be capturable. So by all accounts, we'll be bringing you some Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate on Switch sooner than you can spell all the monsters, because there are a lot of crazy names and a lot of crazy cool ones. This Bloodbath Diablos looks freaking insane. So let us know how you feel about Monster Hunter coming to the Switch in the West. How do you feel about this version, which is AKA Double Cross in Japan, Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate here in the West. Let us know your take in the comments down below. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all the latest and greatest from the Switch and super cool and unexpected announcements like this one. Follow us on Twitter and Discord for up to the minute updates. And until next time, everybody, thanks so much for watching. For myself and Gabe, Switch Force out.